Hey, Mike Phillips down here, 3D Garage. This is a 2023 Genesis GV80 SUV. It's an actually just a beautiful SUV, inside and out. Now, when this car got here, it was completely swirled out and also had um, automatic car wash brush scratches from where the dealership ran it through their car wash. So what we did is a test spot, dialed in a process, buffed the whole thing out, and then we put two layers of the new 3D graphene coating onto the paint. And the glass, all the glass, in fact, everything's smooth. The chrome, everything got the graphene coating on it. And now it does actually look better than when it was purchased brand new. And I'm gonna show you everything we used in case you want to do this kind of work yourself on your own Genesis or any car that you have. So we started out washing the car, uh, pink car soap, wash mitt. After we were done, we used the 3D detailing clay towel to mechanically decontaminate it. We used the yellow degreaser by machine to machine scrub the tires, beaded X plus a brush to get the wheels clean. Uh, we actually machine applied the machine, uh, the magic blue dressing. So that's why you see two different brushes. This was cleaning, this was machine applying the dressing. Tires came out beautiful looking. And then uh, we found out that the paint on this car is not really hard. In fact, I'd say it's kind of soft medium. It's not super soft, but it's not hard. So it's kind of in that sweet spot where you want it. And we were able to get about 95% correction using just 3D1 with the beast and then count how many pads we used one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve twelve pads and i show this because most guys don't use enough pads and if you look see that brownish color around the outer edge that's usually where traffic film or road film that builds up on the paint and the glass everything it when you're buffing it comes off and it builds up on the face of your pads see so i'm always telling people that you know your car gets a film of dirt that doesn't wash off and it doesn't clay off but it does come off when you polish it so we did all the correction work with 3d1 the flex beast 12 polishing pads then um, i always pour my 3d wipe off into a larger 32 ounce bottle just it's a lot easier to use plus it it atomizes really good and then we put two layers of the 3D graphene infused ceramic coating on there. And um, we used beat it up. At this point, we used it for all the door jams, um, for the engine compartment, and uh, just to kind of spruce up a couple areas, and also on the grill. Uh, a swirl finder light always helps to look for high spots. Anyway, so that's what it took to take this from neglected to respected, and this thing looks good. And you can get all these products up at 3dproducts.com. And if you've got any questions, always feel free to reach out and ask me. You can get me at mike.phillips at 3dproducts.com.